Okay, hi, my name is uh, Jim Oberweiss. I'm president of Oberweiss Asset Management. Uh, we are a global small cap uh, investment manager based in suburban Chicago with offices in Chicago, New York, and London. And we look for undervalued small cap stocks, generally in the growth space. And our strategies seek to exploit uh, market anomalies that are documented by academics. Um, specifically, we seek to exploit post-earnings announcement drift. It's one of the most persistent market anom anomalies with abnormal returns that are documented to be quite substantial. Effectively, what we do is poke around countries all over the world looking for companies where there's an inflection point of change, be it an earning surprise or a new product um, or a new management team. And we try to um, exploit human behavioral finance tendencies to um, be a little slow on the reaction to that new news. We found, and academic research backs us up, that it takes sometimes as much as a year for that um, new information to be reflected in stock prices. Uh, sometimes it's because people are anchored in their beliefs and have cognitive biases, and other times it's because of incentive structures for analysts that um, incent them to continue to downplay estimates as opposed to ramping them up to um, true expectations. Um, we offer our services through privately managed accounts for clients with as little as 500000 um, or you can invest in our strategies through our no load mutual fund family that's available at places like Fidelity and, uh, and Schwab. We have a truly global team. We have 14 investment professionals. Um, most of us have MBAs from schools like University of Chicago or Harvard or Northwestern. We're a um, very multilingual team. Our team speaks uh, Chinese, Japanese, uh, German, um, and, and, and we're scattered all over the globe, so it helps to find those types of undervalued opportunities. In my panel sessions, I'm going to talk a little bit about cognitive biases, about um, how to find small cap growth stocks before the rest of the street, and why it's important to look at inefficient asset classes like small caps um, when you're looking for undervalued stocks. We'll talk about some of our favorite ideas, and we'll talk about our, some of our favorite geographies and places to look uh, right now. Thanks again. Look forward to seeing everybody at the upcoming San Francisco Money Show.